On Memorial Day 2022, I found myself making a pit stop on my way home in the town of Simsboro, Louisiana at the Control Point 110 crossover. Local Job 20 was arriving in the town with a classic Grey Ghost GP38-2 on the lead. Job 20's next task on today's agenda was to drop off four grain hoppers at the new feed mill in town. Here we see KCS 2033 already in the siding, slowing down to prepare for its drop. You'll notice to the right the spur track that leads to the mill. The 2033 was originally a motor for the TPNW, built in 1977. As the TPNW was merged into the famous Santa Fe Railway, the Jeep would follow along until being acquired by Kansas City Southern several years down the line. With Grey Ghost being somewhat of a challenge to catch these days, it was nice finally getting another chance to film one in action. It's pretty interesting how at one time, a younger me was struggling to catch Southern Bells, and now it's the exact opposite. The crew of Job 20 will apply the handbrakes to the several cars behind the hoppers destined for the feed mill. The local will decouple and move forward for the crew to flip the switch and remove the derail to allow a reverse move into the mill. I hope. Five cars, Job 20. Two more. One car.
The feed mill is owned and operated by House of Rayford. You may have seen some of their chicken products in your local grocery stores. The company is based out of North Carolina, I believe, but their presence in North Louisiana is impressive. This footage from May of 2021 shows the progress of constructing the mill and the surrounding tracks. While I wish I filmed more of the progression, it's pretty neat to look back at it. The silos were complete in December of 2021. Unfortunately, the shot I wanted of the jeeps along the curve with the mill in the background was blocked thanks to the local actually being too long today. So I'll have to try again someday in the future in hopes of a shorter local. It wouldn't take long for the hoppers to be dropped and for our power to move out of the spur track to the siding. The local still has plenty of work to do, but this is where I would pack up the cameras and head home. Hope y'all all enjoyed watching, and if you did, leave a like down below. And as always, I'll see you somewhere out by the rails.